Today, I'm testing Kling AI's custom model feature to see if it can consistently generate a recognizable character. Let's find out if it's worth your time. First, we generate a prompt for mid-journey using ChatGPT for our model. We input this prompt in the search bar of mid-journey, set our desired parameters, choosing a landscape aspect ratio of 16 to 9, and then click Submit. We wait for the result and select one of the created models that fits best. This one looks good. Now we click on Upscale to enhance the quality further and wait briefly until our model is created. Here's a better version of that. We can now animate this to create a video by selecting low motion for minimal facial movements. We submit it, and in a short time, Midjourney generates four different variations for us to review. This one looks quite good, we will download it. Next, we can extend the video resulting in a longer clip. We wait again for it to be created and choose the best option. After that, we upload it to Kling.ai. This is the first step. You need a 5 to 15 seconds video of your model in 1080p, which we have just uploaded. Now, Kling.ai wants us to create 10 to 30 additional videos for this character to train the model. I go back to mid-journey, take the created image, and insert it into OmniReference. This step is crucial as we want to create consistent characters in different scenarios. I have already written down the suggested backgrounds in a text document for an easy copy and paste into Midjourney. I proceed step by step, starting with a model featuring large hand movements. We set everything as needed and click Submit. Then we repeat the process using OmniReference for each action. I've consistently used a white background because, based on previous tests, other backgrounds didn't perform well and also got rejected by Kling AI. Model combs hair. Model waves hello. Model turns head. Model looks up and down. Model speaks. Model smiles. Model is surprised. Model is sad. Model sits. Model walks. Model surround shot. Model shoot from far to near. Now that we have created our model in different environments, we can create videos of it. To do this, click on Animate again for the images you like. When you view the image in detail, you can choose between Auto and Manual. But in my experience, Auto works very well in low motion. Now we have created our videos and can once again choose from the four different options that Midjourney suggests. I will choose about two videos from each group to have a good selection for Kling AI. I won't show you every single download, but see you in a second on the Kling AI interface. We now upload our 10 to 30 new videos of our model here and wait for Kling AI to process them. As you can see, 17 of our pictures have been accepted. Failed videos are those that, in Kling AI's opinion, do not look like the original model or, for example, if the face is too small. For our test, however, we are satisfied with this selection. Training the model regularly costs 1,999 credits. However, it is currently being offered to me for a reduced price of 999 credits. We are now waiting until the training is finished. In my case, it took about an hour. To call up the model, click on Assets in the sidebar, and then on Models at the top. In the next step, we create videos with the model. You can now click on Generate directly via mouse over or first on the image, and then Generate, depending on what you prefer. The model will automatically be included in the prompt. The face reference will again be our model, Anna. You just have to type what you want her to do. We do not need sound in this case. Let's take a look at the settings and have our model shopping in New York. Click Generate. This costs 35 credits. 
We will review the results afterward. Now, let's use a second prompt and let the model walk along the beach. Click Generate again. Finally, a third prompt is sitting in a bar. Click Generate once more. This also costs another 35 credits. Here are the results. I think I could have achieved a higher quality if I had trained the model with more and better videos. But for demonstration purposes of this short test, I think you will get the idea and how it works.